My dear Christian, I will talk in a very, very important topic. Watching this video and achieving what I will say now is very, very important. Watching this video and achieving from th from the beginning to the end is very, very important. Watching this video is a matter of life or death. For that, I want to hear, to, to, to hear me very well. Hear me with your heart. Don't hear me with your ears. I'm sure if you hear me with your heart, my talking will betray your heart because most of Christians are not arrogant, are not proud. If they know the correct way, they hear the correct way. If they know, the, if they hear the correct advice, they follow the correct advice. I will talk about very great and incredible scientific miracles in the Holy Quran and also I will make spots about a very important points in your book. Hear me for six minutes or five, seven, seven minutes and then you are free. The God said in Surah Dariyat, in chapter number 27, in verse number 47, and we constructed the heaven with strength and indeed, and we will keep expanding. We constructed the heaven with strength and we will keep expanding, which means that the God said from more than 1,400 years that he will keep expanding the heaven. How the Prophet Muhammad knew that, and the recent science proved that the heaven expands with a very high velocity, which it reaches 30,000 light years every one second, because there are 275 million stars are created or born it every day. For that, the heaven has to be expanded to accommodate these huge, huge numbers of stars. How the Prophet Muhammad, and who is a literate man from more than 1,400 years, near, 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 knew this very important fact, unless he is a prophet from God. In the opposite side, you, say, you said in your book that the God created the six, the six skies, the, the, seven layer, six, the seven layers of the, of the heaven, and seven layers of the ground in six days. And then he got very tired. And, then, and for that, he gave himself a break in Saturday. Is that logic? Is that, is that is that reasonable to say that about the, 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 the about God, Allah, which have, who have unlimited power? You insult Allah in your book. Another very great miracle, the Prophet Muhammad said in the Hadith, if the fly falls in the vessel, dip all of it and then remove it, that one of its wings is a disease and the other is a treatment. The recent science proof that one of the wings of the fly contains antibiotics, which kill the parasites and the microbes which fall from the another wing. For that, he ordered us, the Prophet Muhammad ordered us, when the fly falls in the fissure, to dip all of it. When you dip all of it, it will drop these antibiotics and it will kill the parasites which fall from the another wing it will kill, and it will clean the vessel. There are more than great study in USA and Australia prove very, this very important fact. And now they produce antibiotics from the body of the fly for the treatment of many disease. The Prophet Muhammad said that for more than 1,400 years, unless... He, he is a illiterate man, can read and can try it. Very great evidence and very great miracle which proves that this man is a prophet and this miracle pushes hundreds of Christians to convert to Islam. In the opposite side, you said about the great prophet Dawood that he committed adultery, the big sin adultery with the wife of his army commander. Because he saw her when she was take a wash, take a shower and he loved her body. For, for for that he make a legal relationship, a legal relationship between him with her, behind her husband. Is that logic? Is that is that reasonable? Reasonable to insult the great prophet Dawood? And also he said about the uh, the son of the of, of the prophet Dawood, the big son, that he make a legal relationship with his sister, because she was very very beautiful and he loved her and he, and, and, and she and she said to him how much you will pay to me, to sleep with me, and when Dawood knew. knew that his son make adultery with his brother, with his sister. He got very angry, but he didn't, he didn't punish the, uh, his son because he was loving him. And because, uh, is, that logic? is that reasonable? This is your book. Another very great miracle in our books. The Prophet Muhammad said in the Hadith, uh, every human being is created about 360 joint and he has to offer every day a charity or donation for every joint. His friends said to him, it's too hard to make that. He said to them, if you pray to rakas in the early morning, it will be equivalent to, for, for all that. The recent science proves that every one of us is created about 360 joint, like Muhammad said, from more than 100 and 1000, how he knew that. This fact was well known and discovered only from few years. Uh, another very great miracle, the Prophet, uh, the, the God said, uh, in, 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 chapter, in, in chapter number 27, in Surah al -Nag, in verse number 45 and 46. And he created the two types, mates, the two, the two mates, the male and the female, from a sperm drop when it is emitted. And he created the two, the two mates, the male and female, and female from a sperm 
drop one, it is emitted. Which means that the God said that the, the, he created, that the God create the, the, the male and the female from the sperm of the man. Which means that the sperm of the man controls the type of fetus and there is no relationship between the egg of the woman. And the, how the, this this uh, fact was known was discovered only from few years. The people was 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 uh, 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 thinking that the the egg of the woman controls the type of the fetus until the recent science proof that the sperm of the man contain, controls the type of fetus. There are two two types of sperm, feminine sperm and male sperm. If the feminine sperm fertilize the egg, it will be girl, uh, female, and if the male sperm control, fertilize, it will be, the, the, the fetus will be male. Very great evidence which prove the sincerity and the greatness of the Holy Quran. In the opposite side, you said that the God settled down from from, uh, from his chair for, to the ground, and he meet the prophet, the great prophet, uh, Yaqub. And he, he said to him, can you fight me? And the Prophet Yaqub fight with, with Allah, with God, and he beat him. And, and after he beat him, he hauled him from his clothes and he said to him, I will not leave, I will not leave you to come to settle down, to come out, to, to climb to the sky unless you called me Israel. For that he called me he called him Israel. Is that logic? Is that reasonable to, to say that about Allah and what and you insult that? This is your book, which you which you don't know who who write this liar and these fake fake uh, things. Also, you insult the God and said in your book that the God had an eye rush, eye rush in his uh, after the flood, which which occurs in the period of the uh, the prophet Noah, and the angels go to visit him. The God, the God was sick and he take a head an eye rush in his eye. Is that logic? Is that reasonable? Another very great miracle in our book. The God said, whoever Allah wants to guide him, he, he expand his chest for Islam. And whoever Allah wants to misguide him, he make his chest, or make his breast tight and constricted as though as, he is climbing, as though as he is climbing in the sky. This is an example for the people who don't want to believe. Which means that the God said, from more than 1,500 years, when you climb in the sky, you will feel suffocated. You will feel your side, you will feel that your chest, chest is tight and constricted. And he makes that and is an example for the people who don't want to convert to Islam. Which means that the God said, the recent sign is proof that, if, that when you come out, when you climb in the sky, the percentage of oxygen decreases. Which is equivalent to what the Holy Quran said from more than 1,500 years. How the Prophet Muhammad and knew this very important fact and who is an illiterate man can read and can try it. Another very great miracle. The Prophet Muhammad said, in another very great miracle, the non-believers said to the Prophet Muhammad, if you're really a prophet from God, split this moon for us into two parts and we believe you and support you. He said to them, can you give me a charter? He promised, he said, yes, yes. He prayed to God and the moon has split it into two parts. They said to him, you charmed us with magic. This is magic. He said to them, why you broke your promises with me? I achieved what you want. He says, no, this is magic. He said to them, there are messengers will come after two days, we can ask them, if they saw, which you saw, this means that it is not a magic. They said, okay, because you know that the magic affects only the people in front of you, but doesn't affect the people far away from you. The messengers came after two days and said, we saw a very strange thing, we saw that the moon has split it into two parts and was astonished, what is the matter? They said to him, no, 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 your magic is very strong, it goes for a long, for a long way. For that, the God, the God settled down. In chapter uh, number 27, in verse number one, in Surah Al-Qamar, the last day has been soon. And the moon has split it. And if they saw a great miracle, they don't believe. And they said it is a strong magic. And this is always the character of the non-believers. They ask for a great, great miracle and then they broke their promises because they are liar and arrogant. And I hope you are not like these people. When the instrument dropped on the surface of the moon, they found a very long crack. The, the length of this crack is 125 kilometers. And the width of this crack is 1,500 meters. And the depth of this crack is 500 meters. They was astonished because they don't, they never see a crack like this on the ground. They make studies about this crack. They found that this crack impossible, impossible to come as a result of earthquake or volcano or any another thing. And one of the scholars of NASA agency said that our studies prove that the moon has broken in the past and is then sealed another time, which prove without any doubt that the God has split the moon for his prophet from more than 1,200 years as the Holy Quran said. In the opposite side, you said in your books that the great prophet Lot 
make the big sin adultery with his daughters and he and he make and he made them pregnant from him is that logic is that reasonable to insult the great prophet Lut and said to him that he make adultery the big sin with his daughters and make them pregnant from him and this is your book this is your book uh, another very great miracle a, a, a big scholar called Masaru Emoto, he was a Japanese non-Muslim uh, scholar, make a great book called Message from Water about the incredible effect of reciting the Holy Quran on water. He found strange, many strange things. He found that the crystals of the water, it changed it after reciting Quran on it and moved to make very beautiful structures like uh, geometric structure. He take images, photos for this, uh, for this photo, uh, for this uh, uh, image uh, photos uh, for these crystals and he put them uh, he put them in his book and he make studies about the about the water he found that the benefits of the water and the character of the water it changed to be better and better into the treatment of many diseases after reciting the holy quran on it and he wrote that all that in his book message from water i will be I, I will write all that under this video i will write eight great miracles provided with links to prove what i say now did you, uh, did you, did you, uh, this, did you, did you, did you don't believe until now that this Holy Quran is from God? If you don't believe, I'm sorry to say to you that you are arrogant or you are, you are, you are arrogant. Because, because if I told you to look at the sun in the sky and you told me that you don't see anything, this means that you are arrogant or you are blinded man. Because you have to know that the greatness and the strength of the miracles in the Holy Quran and Sunnah is stronger than the light of the sun in the sky. And you have to know that the the Holy Quran, which contains all these miracles, said in Surah Ali Umran, in chapter number 3, in verse number 85, any person will accept any religion unless Islam will not be acceptable from him and will be from the, from, from the big losers in the last day. And the, last, and the Prophet Muhammad said in the Hadith, I swear with whom my soul is in his hand, any person hear about me, Jewish or Christian or any other religion, and don't believe me and don't believe the religion I came with, he will be one of the hell people. You will be one of the fire people if you don't convert to Islam. I made this video because I care about you. I'm afraid about you. I, I don't want you to go to fire. You will fall in fire and you will never, never, never come out of it. Don't destroy yourself. Don't lose the paradise. You will bite your fingers in the last day and you will cry, but you will not cry with tears. You will cry with blood. And you will, you will remember what I say now. And you will blame yourself and stroke yourself because you don't obey me. But the time will be off and the door will be closed. And you will hope to return to the life for one second to convert to Islam. But impossible. Now, I finished what I want to say. I want to say one thing. Drop under this video and read all the miracles I have written and press the links to make sure of, 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 of all of them. And then you, and after that, you don't have any excuse. If you don't convert to Islam, you will be the killer of yourself.